Coming back to heads up action at uh, Chase Bracelet Season 3, Game Number 11. And the chip counts are darn near even. Joe Brunson with 29,500 and Rob Newman with 30,700. Wow. So pretty close. And if you haven't been watching, that's Joe on the left in the gray and Rob Newman in the red on the right. Tonight's game is being done by Train. Fantastic dealing. Fantastic dealer. Yeah. Yep, we're good to go. What's his blind number? 612. Oh, there we go. There's their card. Any predictions on how long this game's going to go? You know what? I, I, it could go in two minutes or it could go. Wow. Joe's got a full house here. And Newman and reaching Rob's for chips. Betting. See, that's what I was going to say. It could go in two minutes. Rob could go crazy or it could go. I mean, you saw Joe fold him or play them jack so slow. It could take a while. Yeah, full house. Oh, continuation to him again. Gotta bet it. Raise it to twelve. What was Newman's bet? Original bet was 4600 4, Okay, 4600 4, and raised to 12000 And Rob putting the Hollywood on now, acting like he's got a big decision to make here. He's got absolutely okay. nothing. He could go all in. He couldn't do that here, could he? Nah. I don't know. Try to not represent after, the flush. Not or after Joe showed him them jacks like that and he's playing so tight. He can't. That's true. Yeah, he's, he's acting like he folded an ace. Hmm. Shows the full house. So maybe that Hollywooding was to do that. stack there. Yeah. That <laughs> Joe will be in the chip lead now. Sharing the eight between the two of them. It's amazing how many times Rob's had somebody dominated tonight. <laughs> True. And Joe hits the five, but Rob hits the ten. Wow. Second and in heads pair. up. Yeah, any pair heads up is. I could absolutely so see him getting. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm waiting on you to act. I'm look, and I'm staring right at the dealer button. <laughs> 63. Wow. Good lay down on Joe Brent's fault. Uh, see, that's why I said it could take a while. Oh. You're you laying down his pair heads up. Head up. That was a good fold, though. Yeah. I was waiting because I thought he's playing with chips, and I thought, oh, he's going to bet. Do I shove or do I just pop, pop it and try and get a little more money? What do I do? And, and I look, oh, hey, look, that's the dealer button right there. It's on me. Call. Call's 12. Checks. Checks. Heart draw. Nope. Check. Queen Hyde's going to take it. Check. 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 Check
You have to check it now. Queen high. <laughs> 13 minutes left in the blind. You know, if Joe started showing a little more aggression here, I might I think it might take Rob by surprise. He might take down some pots that he wouldn't. It's hard for a leopard to change its spots. Yeah. He knows how to show it. <coughs> Two more low starting hands. Is both players. There you go. I like it. It's about the only the second time all night he's bet with nothing. Hmm. Well timed there. You know, Dan didn't even thank us for getting him to see him over there. Sharing cards again. Board. Chop, chop. It's like, oh, hey, Both gotta, players play the board. I tell you what, I was watching some of the World Series event they just had at their heads up. I was watching the live stream. Uh huh. It's amazing how oh, aggressive they are. That's broadcasting, isn't it? Oh, yeah. They're running live streams at just about every final table. Is that, is that ESPN or do you go to the, the um, BSOP.com? God, I, remember, I, went through, I went through a link on Twitter. I don't even remember which one it was. Interesting. I'm going to have to look that up. Yeah, they're showing live streams at just about all the final tables. And do they have cards showing? No. There they go. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm oh, kidding. on the live stream, no, no. What's that? Correct. <laughs> no, the uh, live stream the, from the SO, WSOP does not show cards. No, it makes it 24 total. But they play so aggressive heads up. It they is. just had the heads up tournament. Yeah. They raise every button. I mean, boom, they just take turns. Every huh. hand's raised. Huh. It's, it's amazing. Every time I try that at our $25 tournament, oh, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't work. Yeah, and I think this was a $10,000 buy-in. Wow. I believe so, yeah. Newman's been getting the 2-3 a lot. Hasn't slowed him down any, though. All in. All in. 17,700. Newman all in with his 2-3 off. And praying he doesn't get called. Which I can't see that happening. No, I can't either. But. I was all in for 17,700. Oh, yeah. He's been doing that all night. Some of the worst acting I've seen in a long time. Was that, that wasn't even a raised pot that he did that in. No. Limp. Limp yeah. shove. With two, three. Didn't even build the pot. What's that? So, next week I'm going to New York City for the first time. Yeah? Never been? Uh -huh. I want to see, like, everything now well, buttons on Joe to act last, so Rob Newman, I can see him pushing a little bit of a little bit a little bit of a bet out there. Yeah. Yeah. I can see Rob going crazy here and shoving. I think Joe will beat him in a pot if he does. Yeah. Call him. No, just call Jack Seven. Oh, shove now. 
Seven. Seven thousand is the bet. No diamonds. Okay. I thought for new sure Newman was gonna do a stop and go there. Yeah. Rob with an ace. I think we might end it here. Or doubling all in. Yeah. Newman all in. He's got tens. I think this is going to be called. Yeah, I can't imagine him not calling this. What is it? 16,000. 70-30 here. And Joe has chips if he does lose. It'll be back to about even if he loses. It would be almost where we started. Probably a little bit up from where we started. <laughs> king, queen, deuce. Another queen. Okay. I was going to say, and a king would be awful oh, there. Nail in the coffin is the four diamonds. All right, that ends it for game number 11. Or, uh, yeah, game number 11, season three, Chase the Bracelet. I am Tony Price, and joining me is Paul Boston, and we're signing off. Uh, thank you for joining us, Paul. And uh, thank you for having me. It was a pleasure, and we will see you next time. Have a great night, folks.